The ensuing discussions on whether or not the COVID-19 curve is flattening continues to elicit different opinions from different players. According to the Ministry of Health, we are not out of the woods just yet. However, experts say we might have just managed the pandemic with a steep slope being experienced in the past few weeks. We are well aware that our curve has not yet flattened. I think the worst is behind us, at least for Nairobi and Mombasa. According to Lancet CEO Dr. Ahmed Kalebi, the reducing number of positive cases is not about the reduced number of sample size as many claim, but as a result of a change in the number of patients visiting the hospitals and even the number of people testing positive for the virus. Even the number of people coming in with the flu-like symptoms, uh, respiratory illnesses, have reduced uh, the number of cases that they have to follow up as positive contacts, you know, through contact tracing is reducing. So even their request, the number of tests that they're requesting is reducing. Dr. Kalebi further says a huge number of people have already tested positive for the virus, leaving very few people who have a possibility of turning positive. Of people who got infected already and cannot infect others <laughs> anymore. In other words, it's like a fire, you know, if the bush has already burned, there's no more, nothing more to burn. This is as the number of COVID-19 cases in the country rose to 31,015 cases after 379 more people tested positive for the virus in the last 24 hours. 244 more people have recovered after receiving treatment from various hospitals across the country as 19 more people succumbed to the virus. Zainab Mohammed, TV 47.